This video is going to be a review on the algebraic properties. We're going to match column 1 with what's in the box, um, the properties that are in the box. So let's get started. Number 1. What we're doing in number 1 is we're changing the order of the terms. We changed 19 and 27. So when we change the order, that is G, the cumulative property. In number two, we're changing what's in parentheses, okay, what, what we're grouping. The order has not changed. What has changed is the numbers in parentheses. And that is called the associative property, which is letter D. In number three, we're, we're adding a negative number to 234, and we're getting zero. In number three, that property is called the additive inverse property, which is letter A. For number four, excuse me, number four, again, we're changing what's in parentheses. We're changing the grouping, and that is the associative property, which is letter D. In number five, we're adding a zero to our number. And when we add zero, we get that we get the original number. So number five, we call that the additive identity property, which is letter F. In number six, we're taking a number times its one over thirty seven is the reciprocal of thirty seven. If we take a number times its reciprocal, we always get one. Okay, and I have to say this one slowly. Slowly, it's called the multiplicative inverse property, which is letter E. Now, we have um, excuse me, three more examples. Let me get rid of what we've done and scroll down here so that we can see the other examples. Okay, and when we did that, we lost our box. We're going to bring our box down as well. Okay, and let's get started here with number seven. In number seven, what we're doing here is we're distributing the 12 to both terms. We're taking 12 times 3 and we get 36p, 12 times 4 and we get 48. This is called the distributive property letter B. In number 8, what we're doing is we're just changing the order of the terms. When we change the order of the terms, that is called the associative property, letter D. Okay, and our last one, number 9, we have 452 times 1 and we get 452 when we multiply by 1, that's called the, I have to say this again real slowly, multiplicative identity property, which is letter C. Okay? And that is a brief review on the algebraic properties.